Hello everyone, my name is Juan and welcome to this week's video. And today we're going to talk about the law of cosine. The law of cosines is really helpful if you want to solve different types of triangles. So before we actually solve an exercise, we're going to go over the theory. The cosine law says that the square of one of the sides of a triangle is equal to the sum of the squares of the other two sides minus twice their product times the cosine of their included angle. We can use the cosine law to solve these two types of triangle. This one is a side angle side, so we know two sides of the triangle and the angle in between the two of them. And we can use it to solve for this side. And the other type of triangle that we can solve for is the triple S one, side, side, side. So you know all three sides and we can use it to solve for any of the angles having that in mind let's go for an example for the example we have the following triangle we have a 45 degrees angle we have a side that's equal to 2 and we have the other side which is equal to 4 and we have to solve for the angles a and c and the side b since we only have two sides and the angle in between the two of them we have to use the cosine law. Let's solve for B. So this is our formula. The square of this side is equal to the sum of the squares of these two sides minus twice their product times the cosine of 45 degrees. So we just have to sub in all these numbers in here. So B is equal to the square root of and we're gonna have something like this. If you're using your calculator before you punch in your numbers, please don't forget to set it in degrees because we have degrees here, so please don't forget it. Finally, we end up knowing that B is equal to 2.95. So we get rid of this and we put 2.95. Next, we have to solve for A or for C. We can solve for either one, it doesn't really matter. So I'm gonna pick A. We're gonna use the same formula. So let's sub in our numbers. Let's solve for our angle. To two squared, we have to subtract this two. We have to divide it by negative two times four times 2.95. We end up with something like this. The cosine of the angle is equal to two squared minus four squared minus 2.95 squared divided by negative two times four times 2.95. If we want to get rid of this cosine, we need to take it and take the inverse cosine of this whole thing. Using the calculator, we find out that the angle is equal to 28.7. And there's our answer. I'm going to take this angle and I'm going to write 28.7. Finally, to find C, we just use the property of all the triangles that says that the sum of all its internal angles is equal to 180 degrees. That being said, we know that 45 degrees plus 28.7 plus C is equal to 180 degrees. If we take 180 minus these two angles, we're gonna find C. Doing this, we know that the angle C is equal to 106.3 degrees. And this is the solution for our example. So that was it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and subscribe if you haven't yet. If this video was helpful to you, please don't forget to tell all your friends about it. And yeah, that's pretty much it. And I'll see you all in my next week's video. Don't worry, baby. Oh, 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 oh.